There are five elements that form the core of your chart and that most massively impact your life. They are the life path, birthday number, soul urge, expression, and personality number. And by intimately understanding your numbers, you'll uncover many fascinating truths about who you are, how others perceive you, and the unique opportunities that lay ahead. The most important number in your numerology chart is your life path. It reveals your most fulfilling life direction and the major lessons you're here to learn. It highlights the specific opportunities and challenges you'll encounter and your unique personality traits that will help you on your journey. Your life path is calculated by simply adding up the digits of your date of birth. Your life path number is a six, and this tells me a lot about you. You are sensitive and empathic with the gift of making everyone around you happy. You are devoted, certain, and in charge in all ways. Responsibility and service are two of your most important qualities. You're always looking for ways you can support a greater cause and have the rare ability to comfort those in need. You are intelligent, creative, and naturally very balanced. People often seek you out for advice and support, and that's because you provide profound wisdom without judgment. You are often admired and adored, which baffles you. You are humble, yet carry a strong sense of pride in everything you do. You have the tendency to put others first, which can leave you feeling drained or taken advantage of at times, but it's only because you have such fierce loyalty and commitment to those you love. Continue to guide and support others while loving yourself too, and you'll effortlessly achieve your full life path potential. Next, let's look at what is known as your expression. This is another extremely important element in your numerology chart, as it highlights your natural talents and abilities, many you likely didn't know you had. It's often called the destiny number because it reveals a great deal about your potential and what you're meant to accomplish in this lifetime. While your life path is calculated using your date of birth, your expression is calculated by analyzing the letters of your full name at birth. Why your name? It represents the inheritance of your personal history up to the moment of your birth. Each letter and corresponding number, like a mosaic, combine to form the complete picture of who you are and who you're meant to be. Your name at birth is said to be the blueprint of your potential. To get a free personalized expression reading based on your full name, please enter it above. I'm so glad you decided to stick around and get your personalized expression reading based on your full name at birth. As you'll see for yourself in just a moment, your expression number, or what is sometimes referred to as your destiny number, is one of the most telling elements in your numerology chart. Unlike your life path number, which uncovers your most fulfilling life direction and the major lessons you're meant to learn along the way, your expression number produces a highly potent and accurate profile of who you are and the magic you put out into the world. It reveals the innate gifts you were born with and predicts your ultimate potential. Your expression number is calculated by adding up all the digits that correspond to the letters of your birth name using the Pythagorean alphabet. It can be a bit time consuming to do the math by hand, so I took the liberty of calculating and interpreting your expression number for you. Based on my calculations, your expression number is 2, and after getting to know you a bit better, it's really no surprise. 2 is the number of cooperation. You are compassionate, diplomatic, and an excellent communicator. You care deeply for those around you. Your strongest inner gifts are your ability to form powerful partnerships and bring balance and harmony to any situation. You've probably found that failure only knocks at your door when you get too tied up in other people's problems or insecurities. You achieve great success through common effort and working in peaceful coexistence with your peers, so keep it up. Because you're so reliable, at times you get frustrated with others when their sense of cooperation slips and they leave you hanging. But when many others would think it a better idea to give up or go at it solo, your patience and understanding always puts you back on top of a winning team. You have a rare gift for bringing out the best in people. Continue to lead by example and empower others, and it's almost guaranteed that you'll make positive impressions that will open many doors for you. 
please know that there is still so much left to explore in your unique numerology chart. And if you'll allow me, I'd like to give you even more insight into your life, relationships, and true purpose by analyzing your soul urge number. Your soul urge number, also called your heart's desire number, represents the inner you. It exposes your hidden motivations, deepest cravings and urges, likes and dislikes. It reveals the true intention behind most of your actions and decisions. In just a minute, you'll discover your soul urge number and meaning. But first, to make sure this reading is as customized and accurate as possible to your current life circumstances, I just need a bit more information from you. Please go ahead and enter it now, above. You'll also see that we ask for your email address. This is so we can send you written transcripts of your personalized reading, so you can refer back to any time you'd like. When you enter your email address, you'll also become part of our thriving community and receive regular updates, special invites, and content from our panel of expert columnists. This is completely optional. I've got all the information I need to complete your personalized numerology reading. And, you guessed it, I saved the best for last. Now, a word of caution. The information I'm about to share with you is incredibly intimate and may raise a hair or two. Most people are often shocked at the accuracy of these readings. And I think you will be too after you hear the intriguing truths I've discovered about your personality, hidden motivations, and true purpose. If you choose to listen on, do so with an open mind. And this insight is sure to bring you immeasurable rewards. I'll start by examining your soul urge number. Your soul urge, also called your heart's desire, shows what your soul needs to grow and evolve in life and relationships. Like your expression number, it's derived from assigning numerical values to the letters of your full birth name using the Pythagorean alphabet. Except, in the case of your soul urge, you look only at the vowels. Here's why. Consonants are pronounced with sharp edges and have a definitive beginning or end. They represent your public personality and the traits you outwardly share with the world. On the other hand, vowels are pronounced from free-flowing breath and have softer edges. They represent the true, tender, and often hidden you and reveal your deepest soul urges, many you likely didn't know you had. The famous Renaissance doctor, translator, and astrologer, Marsilio Ficino, devoted much of his life to studying the incredible ways one's life improves when he or she follows the promptings of the soul. The benefits he encountered were undeniable. So, are you curious to know what your soul urge says about you? After analyzing the vowels of your full birth name, I've discovered that your soul urge number is six. Whether you know it yet or not, you have a strong sense of responsibility and are the one person everyone turns to for help. You are a great lover of home and family and seek to make peace rather than disturb it. You have an innate sense of beauty, harmony, and compassion, and a strong calling to be a counselor, peace worker, artist, or teacher. Because of your diplomatic nature, you are often called on to settle disagreements in both your private and professional life. You have a tendency to put your needs on the chopping block in order to help others, but it's only because it's your soul's urge to work for a grand cause that supports your sense of contribution. You are a true humanitarian, but be careful not to get into situations where you are doing everything for everyone or being taken advantage of. Allow yourself to be supported from time to time, and there's no doubt that you'll achieve the appreciation, respect, and harmony your soul craves. When it comes to relationships, you value companionship and commitment. It can be hard for you to move forward in life without a sharing and stable partnership. You have a sensitive nature that can make you a bit vulnerable, but allows you to reach deeper levels of love than most. You would do just about anything to make the one you love happy, which makes you nearly the perfect companion. But that's not all I've discovered about you. Like an onion, you have many, many layers. And after digging a little deeper into your numerology chart, I can see that you have plenty of unique traits and personality quirks left to explore. I get the sense that you're somewhat unpredictable and a bit of a non-conformist. Things that normally please other women simply don't excite you. You're non-compromising and refuse to settle. Because you're a beautiful woman, you often attract partners who are only into your looks. This can be frustrating because you're incredibly smart and have a deep soul. You tend to be a perfectionist and a bit competitive in the workplace. You're self-expressive, have strong purpose, and are not afraid to go out and get what you want. I get the sense that you used to be or are currently in a position traditionally held by a man. I see you dressed to the nines and accomplishing everything you set your mind to. You have a confidence that few have. Not to say you're aggressive or forceful, but you aren't afraid to take risks. 
This makes you quite entrepreneurial and far from domestic by the traditional definition, although you do take great pride in your home and are an incredibly giving and caring individual. I get the feeling that you will get married and have children, but that will be down the road a bit because you have other exciting things to accomplish in your life right now. When you do decide to get married, you won't be one to simply sit around. Even if you marry a millionaire, you'll always have your own projects and goals to work on, and that's because you have a curious and investigative mind that needs to be challenged. I see you as very intuitive, perceptive, and animated. Someone who has excellent communication skills and a diplomatic nature. 